Zooming up north to uh, to Canada, and our next guest, the wonderful Dr. Michael Lagi. Hi there, Michael. Hi, Kevin, and everyone else tuning in. A pleasure and an honor to be back again this week. I have something very fascinating. I, I hope you'll find it fascinating out there. Anything involving spiritism or spiritualism, if you will, fascinates me intrinsically. I, I don't know why. Um, however, that whole movement really started to become very popular in the 1800s on and seeking guidance from the spirits and ghosts always seemed to be a, a thing, table tilting as well. And people still, still actually believe that ghosts, spirits, poltergeists perhaps, offer a kind of advice or wisdom. We're going to see if that proves to be true. I'd like to borrow somebody from the audience, if I may. So if we can bring up somebody, that would be greatly appreciated. We're going to, uh, ah, it's the lovely Jill. Hello, Thank you darling. So Hi, Jill. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm, I'm good. Thank you so much for joining us this day and assisting me. We're going to use a little notepad, and in this notepad, hopefully you can see, I've scribbled various things, the tools of the trade, if you will, the crow's feather, bell, oracle mm -hmm. card, all that sort of thing, wax seal. It's, it's old stuff that I, I tend to favor, the pendulum, Ouija board, often used for divination and, and other things as well. I'm going to ask you, please, if you will, as I riffle through, and I'd like you to get a good look here. As I riffle through like so, I'd like you to say stop whenever, if you'll pardon the pun, spirit strikes. Stop. Right there. So we've got a word. I'd like you to memorize it. Anybody out there as well watching, I hope you'll memorize that because I've got the world's worst memory indeed. And I think we'll go here. We're going to use for this experiment a miniature slate. And I'm just going to bring the camera down a wee bit. We're going to use the slate. I hope you can see it. But we're also going to use what I call my black shroud of mystery. Yes, thank you very much. And a piece of chalk, a wee piece of chalk. Now, hopefully, if all conditions are correct, we're going to receive, hopefully, a bit of a surprise, perhaps a bit of information, if you will. I don't know. Let's focus. I'd like you, if you will, please, Jill, focus, focus on that word that you saw. Do you remember it? Don't mention it right now, but do you remember it? Yes. Keep it very clear. Keep it very clear in your mind. As something begins to occur, it's almost as if the spirits, the ghosts are busy at work. Perhaps they're scrawling something upon the chalkboard. I don't know. I don't know if this worked or not. We'll know in a second. I believe it did work. Oh, that is spooky. Lots of fun. Thank you so much, Jill, for helping. And thank you, everyone else, for putting up with me. Thank you, Flower. Thank you. <sighs> Uh, thank you, Dr. Michael Lucky. Ooh, sweet stuff. 